Okay, so now we're looking at the sphenoid bone. It's the one that's shaped like a butterfly here. So we have the greater wing uh, and the lesser wing. And then um, we have our pterygoid area. So we see pterygoid flip to the bottom. We have our medial pterygoid plate and our lateral pterygoid plate. In between them we have the pterygoid fossa and the hamulus comes off of the pterygoid plate right here. So then, looking at our orbit here, we have the superior orbital fissure, inferior orbital fissure, and the optic canal or optic foramen. At the inside here, starting at the superior orb orbital foramen, we're going to look at our Ross foramen. So that's the foramen rotundum, the foramen ovale, and this foramen spinosum. And then here in the center we have the cella tersica. And here's a posterior view of the optic foramen. I already pointed out the superior orbital fissure. And here is the inferior orbital fissure. To the hamulus one more time. So if we're looking at our pterygoid area, medial plate, lateral plate, fossa, coming off of the medial plate of the pterygoid is the hamulus. This one looks like it's broken. Probably should be a little bit longer than that. Perfect.